Hey guys, this is Pavel from Awesome Presentations. Uh, in this guide, I will show you how to do um, a double exposure picture. So for that, we we need a first picture. Um, it would be best if your picture would be black and white. If you don't have black and white picture, you can simply convert it into black and white uh, just simply by using PowerPoint. Um, so this one's going to be just fine. OK. Now, now we're going to do, um, uh, I'm going to choose a shape. I'm going to choose a preform shape. And I will try to roughly recreate the shape of um, of, of our picture, the shape of a person from our picture. So let me do that quickly. You don't need to be too meticulous about it. Um, uh, we're still going to edit it at the end, but the more precise you're going to be, the better effect you're going to have. That's basically the base, baseline. So let me start with drawing that. Okay, since I got this, um, now remove outline from that shape. And let's insert a picture that we want to have an overlay upon. Okay, now crop that picture to match the size of your slide. Um, I'm not entirely happy with having such an empty space here. I rather to have the forest uh, being seen through the through the through the picture. So I'm gonna rotate it. You know, that's much better. Now let's let's also rotate our picture. Go back to our shape format. Um Let's solve the edges. Oh, might be too much. OK. Now let's set transparency, the picture. Okay. Let's work on our background. Um, first of all, we have a lot of empty space um, within the original picture. We want to make sure to remove that. OK, so choose format. Um, go to the color and set transparent color. And our transparent color is going to be the white background. So we're going to get rid of that. Uh, OK, so now let's uh, set the background of our slide. We're going to do that by inserting the same picture that is overlaying. Uh, I want to, you want to rotate it the same way we rotated the picture within the shape. Uh, put it far back. And now let's extend it. The second step is we're going to try to 
put some tone on that picture in the background by inserting shape, shape on top of it. It's going to be white. No outlines. And we're going to make it We're going to make it transparent, slightly transparent, very little, just to see a texture of the forest. And let's move it back. Okay, I think we are almost done. Um, I think we can make the shape slightly bigger, just to go over a bigger part of the original picture. Make that overlay a little bit more outstanding. Let's play around with color. Um, okay, something like that. Try to squeeze the picture a little bit. Okay. Let's see if we would have a better effect if if we're gonna if we would increase the soft edges. Let's see. Yeah, I think that's not bad. Let's just add some font to it. Okay. I think we are done. If you like this video, if you like this idea, please leave the thumbs up. If you'd like to see some more guides um, and some more ideas and PowerPoint tricks, please subscribe to stay up to date with new videos. Thanks. Take care.